Hey, I have just cut myself some questionable curtain bang, curtain, curtain bangs, curtain, curtain. We actually call it a bloody fringe in the UK. Can we just keep calling it a fringe? Yeah, it only looks semi okay when it's actually styled, but you know what? It's a problem for another day because we're about to do something weird. I was in boots and I found this. And then of course I went on YouTube and had a look at everyone's reviews. And so, I'm just gonna do it. First things first though, I have to wash my hair. Um, it's not that dirty, but you have to wash it. Look at these roots. Like, <sighs> I'm a natural blonde and my roots are saying brunette. So we're gonna try and make this sad time happy with some pink hair. Let's go and, well, I'm gonna have a bath. I'm gonna have a bath. I am clean, my hair's towel dried. I'm gonna have to go and do this in the bathroom, I realized, so sorry if the footage is shit. I look, when I wear my dressing gown, I look like an old, like, what am I doing? I've never dyed my hair, the most I've done is like a tiny blue streak in it. Um, I mean, I've dyed my hair, but I haven't done it myself. So here we go. not pink <laughs> look at this spot in the middle of my freaking forehead why also gave myself some fake freckles today and i actually really love it i think it's so cute um you can still see a little bit of pink going on but it didn't work the way i wanted it to so i spent all morning in the bath washing my hair okay so we're moving past it it's fine it's a new day a nude <laughs> and I need to clean my entire flat it's a mess um I'm depressed and in lockdown and my house gets messy even though I don't fucking do anything so it's time time lapse time Ooh. This heavy I'm not gonna lie <laughs> what the fuck? Emma Chamberlain washing second bagel of the day <laughs> so it is the next day and now I need to get back to doing the living room and the bathroom so let's go <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Just me interrupting your scheduled programming to tell you how much, how much I fucking hate Hermes. When I order something and it's going to be delivered by Hermes, I already know it's going to go tits up. I watched the woman, you have to walk past my window to get to the door. I was sat there drinking my coffee, having a little break from cleaning the bloody toilet. Um, I washed my hands, don't at me. And I saw her as if she's walking back and I was like, right, my buzzer didn't go. My buzzer didn't go. You didn't, uh, uh, so I literally opened the window to see if she can hear me and I'm like, excuse me. No, 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 they fucking drive off. And then I get a, notification we tried to deliver your parcel but you weren't in every fucking time can you tell i'm a little bit a little bit mad about this why is it royal mail can handle it royal mail have no problem fucking anyone else dpd a happy days there's my bloody parcel or oh, do you know what if you're not in we'll leave it with an neighbor we'll leave it with a neighbor do you know, yeah. no hermes they're like oh we attempted delivery like fuck did you attempt delivery i have a buzzer with the number that i live in you press it i'm enraged anyway let's continue <laughs> attention span just can't take anymore um, but I just wanted to show you some obvious new additions to the old uh, living room so let's start with this bad boy firstly this is the only room I meant wall of course I meant wall <laughs> like in you that isn't that hasn't got anything on it um if you got any ideas let me know I've got like a few ideas but I don't I'm not set in stone so if you have any ideas of what I can put behind my settee, that would be nice. Here she is. Does anyone else just throw throws for absolutely no reason? It makes no sense, but it kind of looks cosy because same. Um, I am in love with it. It's from the range. It was delivered really, really quickly. It is so cosy and it fits perfectly like the little bit that comes out doesn't come out too far i still have a box of stuff there it doesn't come out too far so it doesn't like block the bay window or anything i just i love it it's a lovely gray it's really soft obsessed coffee table um i've shown you like my living room briefly in a vlog before i'll pop it on screen in the eye um coffee tables from dunelm rug is old from the range i think i might get a new rug soon as well but that one is doing for now i've got some candles i've got a dw home one lit at the minute bought these the other day from the range also they're like proper marble i've shown you this before also my flowers are fully dead ignore that my keys this little tray and the buddha this is also from the range candle my empty santal 33 bottle most insane fragrance in the world and um, a random screw and then this mirror is from i think this is also done elm so i've shown you this before tape measure look me i'm not that tidy okay <laughs> this is actually georgia's she's just letting me keep it here for now and i really like it actually it does it makes this area look nice i think it needs to come over this way slightly nah, never mind and then the grand reveal Ta -da! my guitars on the wall two floating shelves this is literally exactly how i wanted it and in the evening it's just so cozy ikea plant i feel like everyone has that basically got a plank of wood from b and q and then stained it so it's a little bit darker got the um 
bracket. I really, for some reason, liked the look of the black brackets on other people's walls. So I I got some and I really liked it. And then I've just decorated with stuff that I already have. Knowing me is probably gonna stay like this, but I actually really love it. I love the green and the gold. Here we go. So on this shelf, we've got the infamous Ikea hanging plant that everyone has and the that gold popped is also from Ikea. This is from like a multi-pack of these sort of things from the range. This is from Donnell, love this. Um, little candle, little picture of me and Georgia that used to be my bedroom. I just popped it there because I thought it looked cute. And then the top shelf, this plant is also Donnell. Little monkey, he needs to be holding something but I haven't got anything at the minute. <laughs> that is the range. That's another from that packet I was telling you about. Little plant, I think it's from Primark and then a DW Home Fireside Embers candle. Yeah, obsessed. <laughs> that was my shocking attempt at an OOTD <laughs> right I'm off out on my walk this vlog is a little bit manic I think I haven't edited it yet but I feel like it might be <laughs> just like my brain I I have the worst concentration ever anyway thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you do like my videos because literally 50% of people that watch them unsubscribed not ideal guys <laughs> yeah i'll see you next time bye